Hi Goliaths, before we start today's video, I just want to say a big thank you to Proven for sponsoring today's video. Proven is a skincare subscription that helps you create your own customized skincare. What I think is so cool about Proven is that it's woman owned and ran. It's super easy, all you have to do is take a quiz and answer some questions about your skin, about your lifestyle and the environment that you're in and your past skincare history. I took the quiz as well and one of the questions that stood out to me the most was that they asked if I was pregnant breastfeeding or about to be because as you guys know I'm pregnant which makes me feel more comfortable using their products because I'm asking these questions is making sure that they're not putting any harmful ingredients that can hurt me or my baby. They're super transparent on the ingredients they use and how I can help your skin. I'm not sure if you guys could tell but I'm here in my bathroom and I'm going to show you guys my customized skincare from Proven. What I think is so cool is that it's just three steps and your cover, that's all you're going to need. I'm going to start off with my cleanser and all I need is one to two pumps of this cleanser and just massage my face. Now that my face is dry, I'm going to go in with my daily moisturizer with SPF. What I've noticed about my skin after using the Proven Customized Skin Care is that my face feels so much more firmer and hydrated. And I also have a chapstick from them. It's a peppermint lip balm. If you would like to try out the Proven Skin Care, then the link is going to be down below in the description. And you can use my code LULU20 for $20 off your Proven Skin Care. Hola, comadres. Como están, chiquititas hermosas? I'm finally going to be filming the what's in my hospital bag and diaper bag. And I'm so excited to share everything with you guys. He visto tantos de estos tipos de videos porque como saben que yo soy mamá primeriza, a first time mom, so I was really confused on what exactly I should take or what I'm going to be um, like using because I don't want to take my whole house with me porque that's what I was planning to do. I'm like, oh my God, what do I need? Like, I have no idea. But I think I watch enough YouTube videos to know what most people use and don't use. But honestly, if you would go to the hospital without anything, you'll be perfectly fine because the hospital provides you with all the things you need, need. But I think we're all a little bit extra and we just want to have a comfortable delivery and a comfortable stay at the hospital and that's why we take extra stuff just to make us feel comfortable and just enjoy a little bit of the time that we're there so i'm gonna just show you guys what i am taking if you guys think i'm missing something let me know porque you know pregnancy brain is real so i have no idea if i'm actually missing something or not but i'm really excited i've been wanting to do this video for so long and i'm actually gonna be packing with you guys no no matter estoy enseñando lo que Tengo mi bolsa, like, I have a mess here of things. So I'm going to be actually packing because I need to be ready. Because my baby girl, and I'm so excited to meet her already. And um, I could literally pop at any time now, so I need to be prepared because I'm kind of laggy now. But vamos a empezar. Um, let's pack the baby's bag. First, let me just tell you guys what I have here porque it's already here. And I have to have this next to my bags and my diaper bags porque si estoy en un rush, like, I don't know cómo es esta cosa. Like, no sé si a rápido y, like, sometimes it's, like, a merge. Like, oh, my God. Like, my water broke. Let's leave, leave, leave. Or it's, like, a slow process. Like, oh, let's go to the hospital and have this baby. And maybe if I'm a rush, um, Rogelio es el que va a tener que agarrar todas las um, maletas y eso. So, necesito tener esto listo porque no quiero que se le olvide esto porque es muy importante. Esta cajita o esta hielera es um, donde van a poner mi placenta. Esta es la Mommy Made Encapsulation. Uh, voy a estar encapsulando mi placenta, comadres. Estoy muy emocionada para eso porque de primera vez like, encapsulé mi placenta. Pero cuando empecé a leer todos los beneficios de encapsulando tu placenta y qué te hace, um, I right away was like, yes, lo quiero hacer y lo voy a hacer. So I ordered it and I got here really quickly and I have to do is take it with me cuando voy al doctor. Y decirle a mi doctor, oiga, dame mi placenta. Y luego ya cuando I'm done delivering, le hablo a ellos y ellos vienen. 
y recogen el placenta and then they do all the work, they encapsulate it y luego ya en unos días o una semana me lo mandan mis pastillas y ya me las empiezo a tomar. They have so many benefits, comadres. Go follow them on Instagram if you want to know all the benefits, pero um, unos de ellos que yo sé on top of my head is that um, it helps with postpartum depression, it helps with the milk supply and energy. Pero comadres, do your own research, but I'm really excited to encapsulate my placenta, so necesito tener esto junto donde están mis bolsas. Just, um, let's start with my diaper bag. Me encanta mi diaper bag. Mi hermana me lo regaló. This is a Tory Burch diaper bag. It's in black and it's so beautiful to me. I'm absolutely in love with it. Um, let's open her up. Either wear it like this as just like a regular bag or it comes with this strap right here so you could wear it more longer. And inside it has a couple of departments so you're able to organize everything. And aquí, this is where you change the baby. I have things everywhere like I said because I'm actually literally packing with you guys. But let's start with, um, this is the first thing I'm going to be taking her. It's a little swaddle. I got it on Amazon. A lot of the things I have here are from Amazon. So I'm going to have my Amazon link down below. You can click it and then you can purchase anything you would like. I actually got this um, at Amazon and I've seen these are super popular now. These are the new swaddles. This is a swaddle up. I love to dream. And it's a really cute pink one. So se lo voy a llevar. Um... Para ver si le gusta. Some, people, some babies do not like to be swaddled, but hopefully she does. Y le voy a llevar unos outfits. So, la otra vez les enseñé el outfit que quería que se um, ponga cuando la traigamos a la casa. And all of you guys told me that that one's not going to work porque no tiene como para los pies. Déjenme enseñarles. This is going to be her coming home outfit but porque this one ties around um it won't work because of porque no va a poder ponerla en su, en su sillón and amarrarla bien porque sus pies no van a poder como cruzarse and I was like oh my god that is so smart like I didn't even think about that because obviously I'm a first time mom and I was like okay fine this is not gonna be her coming home outfit which was so sad because it was so cute but I was like whatever I'm still gonna take it to for her to wear it in the hospital and take cute pictures of her so I'm taking this um outfit this one is from Lulu um toda su ropita de esa compañía está tan hermosa y también la calidad me encanta viene con esta y viene con su moñito her little headband it comes with her little mittens and a swaddle so I already have a little swaddle blanket as well. And this was actually one whole outfit, which was perfect. I'm going to put that inside. It's crazy how we're just going to go to the hospital and then we're going to come back with the little baby. Like, that's insane. Okay, so that's the first outfit. That's going to be like for pictures. And then, tengo dos de estos blancos que les voy, le voy a llevar. Uno es newborn en el otro es cero a tres meses. Y es porque no sé qué tan grande va a ser la bebé. No sé si es, va a estar como newborn or she could come out even bigger. So, I'm not going to risk it. So, I'm going to take a zero to three month one. So, I have these two. And also, I got her this little cute um, turban I think it's called and it's like the ones from the hospital y viene con un moño I thought that was super cute so cuando le pongo uno de estos le voy a poner este the last outfit I'm taking her is just a onesie with a zipper this one I got from H&M and I thought it was really cute and it comes with a little a turban and that's all the outfits I'm taking her I think this is her coming home outfit Maybe if I don't change my mind and buy something else, but this one's super cute, so I'm going to take her that one. And también le voy a llevar una cubijita. And then, tres calcetines y un chupón. Y eso es todo lo que le voy a llevar a la bebé. Creo que es suficiente porque, como les dije, que allá en el hospital le van a dar los pañales, los wipes. No le voy a llevar un biberón porque, como les dije, que I'm going to breastfeed or try to breastfeed, so I'm going to take her any biberon, and if I do need a biberon, biberon, then the hospital will give it to me. So that's all I'm going to be taking in her diaper bag, and her diaper bag is ready! Ah! 
Okay, now we're going on to the hospital bag. And for the hospital bag, I ended up going with a suitcase. Porque cuando estaba viendo todos los videos, muchas mamás estaban recomendando que te lleves una maleta y no una duffel bag, no una bolsa donde estás cargando. Porque vas a tener que cargar todo eso al hospital. Y mejor una maleta con ruedas para nomás. Es más fácil, más rápido y está, es más conveniente. So that's what I did. I just got our suitcase. This is the one we always been having. We got it at Ross. And I'm going to be packing todas las cosas mías y Rafaelo aquí. No la tengo arriba de la cama, como les, no se preocupen, está arriba de una toalla porque I know suitcases are dirty and they go everywhere. So you don't want to put them on top of your bed. I have a towel here. But let's go on and see what I'm going to be packing. So, compré estas bolsas y estos son para organizar todo adentro de la maleta. Y lo agarré rositas. So, I'm going to be just organizing todo lo que tengo aquí adentro. They're called travel bags. Uh, I got them from Amazon, so I'll have a link down below. There's different sizes for different things that you need. Voy a empezar con las cosas que yo voy a necesitar. Let's start off with the toiletries. So, fui a Target ayer y compré las cosas que me faltaban. Me faltaban como jabón y todo eso. So, all I got was the travel sizes and this was so convenient. I'm getting esta bolsa que viene con todo esto. Shampoo, conditioner, body wash, deorient, a little scrub, um, pasta de dientes, a toothbrush, and then a razor, which I don't think I'm going to be using. But it's just perfect. So, okay, let me just get it. It comes with a bag. So, that's really cute. Y también le compré el mismo Rogelio, pero esto es de hombres. Y viene con lo mismo deodorant, shampoo, razor, y peine. So, ya, ya está listo eso. Now, for the postpartum care, um, I have these Freedom Mom Instant Ice Maxi Pads. Which I'm gonna pack, but I'm not gonna take this whole bag. So I'm gonna open it and I'm gonna take a couple. I'm not really sure cuántos llevarme. Honestly, ni sé cómo usar esto. Like, I don't even know, girl, but I'm taking them because everyone says to take some ice pads. So vienen así en esos paquetes, and I guess they crunch them up and then they start getting cold. So I'm gonna take. ¿Cuántos me llevo? No sé, chiquita. Cuatro. ¿Crees que me lleve cuatro con eso es suficiente? Ok, I'm going to take four. And if, that, if it's not enough, I know the hospital will have some. But I'm just going to save some for um, here. Cuando llegue aquí, yo sé que lo voy a usar. And I'm also taking the Freedom Mom Upside Down Perry Bottom. La verdad, comadre, esto no tengo idea cómo se pone, pero todo el mundo dice que necesitas comprar estas cosas. So, ahí voy. Esto es the Witch Hazel Pads. I'm taking just one. Vino con dos porque lo compré en Amazon, but I'm just taking one and I'm saving this one from home. And I'm also taking the Dermaplast Pain and Burn and Itch Pain Reliever. I guess you spray that down there as well, but I'm taking it. And then también me voy a llevar estos pañales, pero estos son para mí. Los pañales los voy a poner aquí adentro. Voy a empacar estos sandales que compré en Target. Estos son para bañarme. Compré estos um, granny panties on Amazon. Me gustó porque they have a thick band up here. So it's going to tighten your belly a little bit. But it's not too tight. No están como muy apretados porque no, yo sé que I'm not going to feel comfortable with really tight underwear. So these are the ones I got. They come in a pair of three. Yo no me voy a llevar ninguno de mi maquillaje porque yo sé que yo no voy a querer pintarme. I don't like how makeup feels on my skin. So I'm not even going to try to put makeup on. I am going to try to put lash extensions on before my delivery. So I'm going to look a little bit cute. Hopefully I do make it to my lash appointment. But we don't know. But I do have a lash appointment soon. But the only thing that I'm going to be taking like for myself like uh, to get ready is chapstick. This is the Birds Bee Chapstick. Un peine. Um, ligas. And una de estas um, headbands. So, para que no esté ninguno de mi, mi pelo en mi cara. While I'm giving birth or after birth. So, I'm taking that. Now, I'm also going to be taking a face cream. And that's about it. I'm going to be taking two nursing bras. These I got in Target. And I got them in a the size large. Porque um, iba a dar a mediano, but I'm like, I feel like mediano is what I'm wearing right now. And I know cuando ya me empieza a salir la leche, 
they're gonna grow so much more so I think large is gonna be more comfortable for me so I ended up getting this color and then the color black and they're both from Target and I heard a lot of good things about the nursing um, bras from Target también me voy a llevar esta pomada para mis pezones this is the organic nipple balm now for my outfits I got pure loose outfits and they're not even outfits the first one is this pajama this one has buttons and I thought it was super, really cute this is from Target and it comes with the bottoms which are really loose as well which I think are going to be perfect you don't want anything tight and I also got another pajama set from Target but this one is the más como una como un vestidito and it has buttons no más así and it's loose fit so I'm going to see which one I would want to wear better but I think I'm going to be wearing both of these I'm not too sure and then the last thing is this robe everyone's saying to take a robe so this is the robe I'm taking and then for my coming home outfit también quería algo como que no esté apretada so y esta tela está bien suavecita y no está nada apretada es super stretchy and I got the pants in a size medium it's from Target as well and the top extra extra large no sé por qué lo veré tan grande pero I think this is perfect so I just want to be comfortable so this is going to be my coming home coming home outfit it's pretty cute but that's all I need and that's all my outfits también le empaque a Rogelio que su ropa está ahí I just packed him two outfits and two underwears and it's just like comfy clothes Packing a couple of snacks. These are the ones I'm taking. Some Oreos and chess mix. Y lo último que voy a empacar es los cargadores de teléfono y los cargadores de mi cámara. Porque vamos a tratar de grabar el parto para ustedes and have that up so we could have those memories. So yeah, I have just my tripods, lights, um, chargers, SD cards. Creo que me voy a llevar esto. Esto es para... Esto es una moda para darle pecho a la bebé. La verdad no sé si me la llevo o no. Por favor, coméntenme if you guys think I should take it or not. Because it's so big. I don't know. It doesn't even fit in the maleta. So let me know if you guys recommend taking it or I shouldn't take it. So this is how my hospital maleta looks like. Todo está organizado. And everything has its place. Which looks super cute. So let me just close it up already. Oh my god, I can't believe it. I can't believe I'm officially ready. I am ready. Ya oficialmente estamos listos. We are ready for baby girl. I'm so excited. I'm gonna have everything right there. Y le voy a decir a Rogelio cuando llegue a la casa que um, ya están todas las cosas aquí. So if anything, he knows where everything is. He could just put it in the car and let's go. Vámonos. So yeah. So we're officially done with what's in my hospital and diaper bag. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did. And if you think I'm missing anything, let me know because I think I have everything. I checked my list twice and I don't know, but you know, mommy brain right now or pregnancy brain right now is kind of going everywhere. So just let me know if you think I'm missing anything. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and maybe the next video will be labor and delivery. We don't know. Bye, comadre. Las quiero mucho y las veo en el próximo video. Bye.